You're watching the Steve's Haunted Yard channel. Get your haunt on. Pancakes. What are you doing, Jason? I'm getting some foam. <laughs> we are at Dark Phobia. Dark Phobia storage unit. Storage unit. So look at all these walls. This man's crazy. This guy's a crazy man. All the original Dark Phobia walls back, plus uh, about 25 more. So we, Sweet. So we've got 50 walls, uh, six of which are at the house right now because we're using the stage of skeletons for the G2E home. Okay, cool. And we're grabbing this foam to make a couple of uh, a couple of the photo frames for the moving moving portraits. So we're grabbing this. We're working on those today. Some more cool G2E haunt vlog goodness here really soon. So stay tuned. Look at this evil guy. Stay evil. Here's the electrical genius of the crew. And he's got a big crazy mess going on here. He's doing the power supplies to run the haunt in Vegas. Wiper motors. For all the wiper motors. For this thing that I showed you guys already. That we made because we're geniuses. Just, just like the Obama administration, if it isn't, if it's working, break it to work on it until it's broke. <laughs> <laughs> My vlog just went political. Keep politics out of haunting, please. Yes, I know. Separation of charges, haunt and <laughs> politics, haunt and state. <laughs> Carlin, I like your, I like your extension board. You brought that? Yeah, I, I did bring that from home. I thought it would be very convenient if we had that here while we're haunting, and you know, just it would be great for me to take it back home. No, blocks to Jason. Blocks to Jason. You better keep it on. It's like a, like a. There's like a. Uh, Skeleton orgy going on over here. Look at them. Look at this, people. Are you guys excited? Look at that. Wiper motors. And then this package just came in. This package just came in. Was this from Fright Props? Yes, it is. Look at that. Four more wiper motors right there. How many total wiper motors? Do we have? Are we gonna have? Well, the number keeps going up, so like twelve hundred. I'm not sure. Twelve, eleven, to hundred. So, I'll show you the project I'm working on right now. Um, so for the moving portrait mechanism that I showed you guys that spins, um, we were looking for some large frames, gothic type frames to put photos in, but I'm just gonna make them out of foam, um, so they'll be lightweight. But this will be the backing for the foam, this uh, thin luon. Um, so I'm going to do an oval, a horizontal rectangle, and then a vertical style rectangle. So these are the wood shapes that I'm going to cut out, and then I will put foam on there, and then I will detail them out. So um, that will be fun. All right, so working on the first picture frame uh, foam part. So this is kind of the general shape that the frame will be. Now this is a smaller version. This whole entire piece is going to be recessed into where I'm cutting this out. Um, this will be the back, but this was just my concept of the shape which will be carved on the front half of this. So for now I'm just cutting this to recess this wood to put so it goes down inside the, the foam. So, fun stuff. So if anyone's wondering how to do that, I just use my Dremel and a little router bit. So, and you just go crazy. And then in a minute, I'll just knock all that out of there and it'll be recessed. So I'll show you in a bit. All right, so here's the setup you guys have seen for the spinning portraits. So here's one of them cut out with the backing with the foam on it that I routed out earlier and so I will then have to route out an inset here uh, and then the photo will go in there and then of course I have to carve out this frame to look uh, a little more detailed but there it is there will be three of these um, in the haunt 
And I built the other two boxes today too, so now there's three of them. Please subscribe today.